So it's uh it's early, man. It's like seven thirty in the morning, but I could not wait to release this this information. Um, look through the footage. I told you that Paulie was fucking full of shit. I told you at the last video that I did about Paulie Maligiani that he was a broken guy with a broken fucking attitude. He got his ass whooped. The footage has been released. There is no fucking push down. That's a motherfucking knockdown. Kind of hit him with a combination, touched him in the back of his head, and Paulie went fucking down. You guys keep underestimating uh, uh, Conor McGregor. He's going to shock the fucking world. Come August 26th, Paulie is going to sit behind that Showtime desk and say, Oh my God, Conor McGregor has just shut the world. Talk about a fucking, talk about getting even. Not just does he force his Mayweather uh, 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 fans and everybody else to realize that Mayweather's good. Look, man, Mayweather's amazing. Uh, May Mayweather is it's the most the greatest defensive fight of all time. Was his fight always good? No, his fight was good because the opponent he took on. You always thought that, okay, this guy's going to knock out Mayweather. But he never did because Mayweather got on his bike. He pedaled backwards. You know, he schooled him. Don't get me wrong. Mayweather, once he does that shoulder roll and everything bounces off, boom, boom, and then he ducks. But come on, there's been plenty of time that you see Mayweather in trouble, and he cheats, he hugs. He held on to Shane Douglas, uh, Shane Mosley's uh, arm for dear life. But granted, after that initial knee buckle, Shane couldn't get nothing done. Miguel Cotto was the first guy to bloody him up. They stopped, they stopped, they started boxing. Fucking Miguel lost. Shane Mosley started boxing. Fucking Shane lost. Oscar de la Hoya put some beating on that kid, man. But then started boxing. Guess what? Fucking lost. Uh, my my Ghana tried, man. Was putting heat on him. Was the only one to last long enough to put heat on him. But then guess what? You started boxing, you fucking idiot. And you fucking lost. Andre Berto, that fight was a waste of fucking time. But Andre started boxing, and guess what? They fucking lost. Connor is not a boxer, man. These guys are boxers. They know their science. They know their skill. And that's the all they know how to do is box. You're not going to fucking outbox Mayweather. No fucking way. Connor knows he ain't a boxer, but Connor's not going in there to fucking box. Connor's going in there to fight. And I'm telling you right now, there is nothing. When you got a guy with a single discipline in them, a single discipline, one style, one skill, they know how to do one fucking thing, they become a robot, just like Bruce Lee said it. They can't express themselves because all they know how to do is one thing. Conor McGregor, full knowledge of the fight game. Fight game. There's going to be some cheating. There's going to be some hugging. There's going to be some grabbing. And Conor's going to do all that shit because Mayweather does it too. August 26th, Conor McGregor's going to shock the world. He, he gave... Paulie Maligiani, an opportunity to keep his fucking mouth shut, but Paulie kept on fucking talking shit. That was a push down, that wasn't a knockdown. Paulie, you got fucking schooled, son. You talked all that shit about tying your hand behind your back. Connor released a picture about him both, tying both his hands behind his back while he was whipping your ass. Then, knocked you down. You said that he was uh, he was treating the the, the the, sp the sparring partners is garbage. Got them living in a crack house. Conor McGregor, his team said it's multiple houses. You got caught lying. Yo, I can't believe, Paulie, I hate to be in your fucking shoes right now, man. Because you got to go back to Brooklyn and fucking show your face because you're a fucking full of shit piece of, you're a bitch, bro. 
Now you should have stood there and kept on fucking working. You got upset. Your ego got damaged. Your pride got fucked because you got schooled by a guy who never boxed in his fucking life. But you stupid motherfucker, he's not a fucking boxer. You was fucking boxing. He was fucking fighting. He beat your ass. Come August 26th, he's going to beat Mayweather's ass too. Now I'm going to give it to Mayweather. Mayweather ain't stupid. Mayweather, Wayne, Mayweather, you know, his family upbringing, they fighters, man. They street thugs, man. Look at his pop. His pop ain't going to fucking, his pop don't black down for nobody, brother. If, and, and, and Floyd, your statement clearly said that you're coming forward, that you're upset with the Mac, the, the uh, Pacquiao fight. Dude, what happened to Andre Berta? How come you didn't give the fans... How come you didn't come forward on Andre Berta when he was an easier target for you? You didn't come forward on Andre Berta. You sat back and did the defensive game. Like you always do. And you're going to come forward on a killer? Because Mayweather... McGregor's a killer. August 25th, 26th. Shot the world. August 27th. Ireland rules boxing. <laughs> I painted my walls green. Look. Look behind me. I ain't playing. <laughs> I grew up in Brooklyn. I worked in construction for Olehi. Um, what was it? Oh, oh, yeah. Olehi Construction. I remember some of my best friends, man, during those construction days. We used to go to the pub after. I don't even call a bar a bar anymore. I call it a fucking pub. I've been calling that shit for fucking years. I'm 51 years old, bro. And I've been calling a pub since I was fucking 18. I drink Guinness Stout Dark Beer. The Irish people and me, man, we get along, man. And I ain't saying this, man, because it's true. It is true. They're coming over tonight. <laughs> August 27th I'm gonna sit on this fucking video And say I fucking told you so McGregor's gonna come forward He's gonna attack He's going to attack He's gonna sit back and wait He's gonna attack He's gonna do the combinations He's gonna keep going from South Paul From left to right Left to right He's gonna come. He's gonna hit this guy in so many fucking angles and so many fucking sides. Mayweather's gonna square the guy. He's gonna think he's in there with four fucking guys, bro. You saw his fucking sparring me, uh, his sparring contest as, as conference yesterday. McGregor man ain't playing, dude. He had every fucking bag there, and and he kept shuffling. He kept twisting. He kept going from uh, a regular stance to softball stance. Hmm. Yo, that kid's gonna hurt him, man. McGregor's gonna win this fight. Paulie, you're a bitch.